guys, it's Dan, your host of your Dan's Reviews, and today I'm back for another Fear the Walking Dead video for today. This one is going to be doing, of course, now leading up to what would be the Season 5 premiere. Not too many Game of Thrones videos now. The show's done. It's been over a week, and, uh, you know, a lot of people, they they're, they kind of they kind of don't want me to do any more Game of Thrones videos because of the ending. But, uh, you know, let me know when the, you know, spinoff series come out, if you want me to cover it, or if you guys are like, ah, eh, done with the Game of Thrones videos, and that's kind of it because I am pretty disappointed with the end of Game of Thrones too, you know. Um, I do have to agree. So, uh, but uh, anyway, so uh, let, the community has spoken. I think you know uh, Game of Thrones. People are pretty done with it, uh, you know, for now. So I figured let's do a fear video today. I'm not sure if I can upload a video every week this week because uh, there just isn't many topics. But uh, I do plan on doing uh, some Stranger Things videos leading up to uh, it's season three. But uh, I just can't promise a video every day this week because honestly, there's not too many topics to talk about. But but for today, I figured. Um, Let's give our thoughts on uh, something from Fear that I think is a, a, a question that uh, I think deserves an entire video because I think this is a, a good enough question. Um, mainly because of all the stuff we've been seeing in the trailers for this season and how much they've been advertising Fear Season 5. Yeah, I think it's, uh, you know, they definitely need to, uh, I definitely need to answer this question, what I personally think. So, um, Okay, so Fear of the Walking Dead, of course, started off with season one, uh, and it was, you know, kind of okay, you know? Season two, I felt like, took the show to another level. Season two really was good for the most of it, uh, but there were a few episodes like uh, Los Meritos, or uh, like uh, We All Fall Down with the Family and stuff, or, uh, you know, heck, I'm, I'm talking... You know, uh, what what would be another one like uh, Pablo and Jessica, you know, some of those episodes. But aside from that, there were some really great episodes in season two, especially the mid-season finale. Uh, some of the episodes with uh, Connor's group and some of the stuff with Travis and Chris at the end of season two, really some great stuff. But then season three came out and everyone was blown away with fear. Everyone was just blown away with the with the direction they took the show everybody loved fear season well the, the most people i don't want to speak for everybody here but um mostly everybody enjoyed fear season three. i did you know too like i yeah i loved the season but then so i really think that season three it, it that's the best season of fear i some people might say season four and that's fine but honestly i don't think so i think season four of fear if you're a morgan fan if you're a fan of the reboot maybe but there's that's a very small audience that is a fan of this new reboot they did of fear so you know we have to consider that as well now um season three being the best season will season five surpass it is my question um I look at the the seasons. I look at uh, you know season three, and I just see so many positives. You know, I mean, yes, Travis's death was probably the worst decision of the season. I I I I still believe so, but. You know, we did see a lot. We we did, and the season was good. Season three of uh, of Fear will, and this is the question of the video: Will season three of Fear be better? Will season five of Fear be better than season three, or will season three of Fear always kind of be like the ultimate, like best Fear we'll ever have? You know, that the best, uh, you know, sixteen episodes of Fear we'll ever have. Um. That's really what I'm I'm asking you guys in this video is do you think that season five of fear with you know the Dwight the Daniel crossover and you know Daniel coming back um all the previews they've shown the plane really cool maybe some tie-ins to the Rick movie Morgan just tons of the other characters that we really like to see and potentially uh, you know Troy coming into the season maybe some new villains as well and uh, just a really cool looking story in season five except for some of the cringy uh, trailers they've been releasing uh, as you guys know I made fun of that quite a bit but um you know honestly if I look at season five of fear even though they have made the reboot which that's that is a huge problem for me I personally, with the with everything they did in season three with the ranch and the dam and how incredible that season was and how many awesome characters they had in that season, um, and just some of those amazing episodes, like man, Brothers Keeper. I'm I'm talking Children, uh, Children of Wrath. I'm talking, you know, on. Um, 
the premiere, I'm talking the finale, I'm talking, you know, uh, the under, uh, you know, the, 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 this land is your land with Alicia, the underground bunker episode. I mean, there's so many great episodes in season three. I look at season five and I see, uh, some, some, I see some positives for sure, but I also see that I don't think this season is going to be as dark and as, as great and as, you know, big budget and as, amazing and as many awesome characters i mean we are getting a few characters that are going to be in the series this season that i am a fan of like dwight like daniel like troy probably if he's in it but i personally think that even after um after all the trailers they've given us for season five i could be proven wrong i think season uh season three is always going to be the best season to fear and i don't know if anything will change that because even though the season looks great it at, at times, other times it looks really bad, but, um, I, I really think that, uh, you know, season three is just one of those seasons that I, I don't think, it's one of those rewatchable seasons, it really is, and I don't think if I'm, if I'm being 100% honest, this year's season will pass it, maybe another season in the future if the show goes on long enough, but for, for right now, this season, I think season three is still going to stand at the best season, but you never know, you really never know, if they kill off more characters this season, if they really do some amazing episodes and just blow, blow season three out of the water, then may maybe, maybe, but I just, I, I, I look at season three and I look at season five and I look at season five and I think to myself, wow, you know, even though certain parts do look good. It just feels like season five of Fear is going to be so light. It's just going to be so like, you know, uh, week to week, you know, what we'll see some kind of like, it'll be very Z Nation-ish. That's what they're really making Fear. They're really, if you guys have ever seen Z Nation, you know what I mean. It's very Z Nation-ish, like the accordion mention, a cat, like I get it, it's kind of cool, but it's like, what's the point of seeing an accordion and the, and it's like all of this and they're mentioning how like uh, beer will be like continue to be a thing in season five. Honestly, that is such a cringy, like, way to put it. Like, I just, I don't know. I see so many cringy, like, trailers of Season 5 of Fear, and I see so many great trailers for Season 5 of Fear, like, at the same time, and that's why I'm like, man, Season season 3 of Fear was promoted so well, I feel like. They had some great trailers for Season 3 of Fear, and the season was the best. So, that's really my opinion. Write yours down in the comment section below, though, because I want to hear from you now. And, of course, if you have uh, any more discussion topics for Fear leading up this week, uh, write that down in the comment section below. If not, then I might not do too many. But uh, if you do, write that down in the comment section below. And I might do... Some Stranger Things videos as well. Maybe, maybe another video on uh, The Plague made by Undead Freak 78 because I haven't... Um, made a video on the plague in a while and he actually hasn't made a video in a couple weeks too so yeah uh well that's that's really why it's just because there hasn't been anything new on the uh the plague so any of the plague fans sorry about that but uh just don't uh, don't have any topics really for uh for the plague so really not that many topics until we get this premiere this weekend but uh, if there's any other stranger things videos or any more game of thrones videos or anything like that write that down in the comment section below because i don't want to go an entire week without making any videos i want to at least make a couple videos this week and i think uh, i think i can come up with some uh, pretty good videos uh but uh, you know if you guys help me out and you guys give me some great suggestions and it might be even better so perfect uh so anyway thank you guys so much for watching this video and if not by the way if you don't have any topics that's totally fine um I'm really just asking because, uh, you know, I know you guys always come up with some great topics. So, anyway, uh, write that, uh, write down in the comment section below. Do you think season uh, five will uh, be better than season three of fear? I say no, but, you know, write that down in the comment section below again. And uh, thank you guys so much for watching this video, and I'll catch you guys in the next one. Peace out.